Hi, Gemini's. Welcome to your reading. Guys, we are doing a message from your person, not in-depth tarot reading. Y'all know that. We use mainly message decks. I'm pulling um, your energy from this deck, their energy, but we're doing it from their perspective. Mm -hmm. That'll get us started. Hopefully, it'll give you confirmation of who it is coming forward for you. Spirit, bring in Gemini's person, the strongest energy forward, please. Y'all know all my readings are meant to bring you confirmations of things you already intuitively and instinctively know or sense about the person and the connection. <clears throat> if it doesn't happen with this reading, check out your other sign positions. I also did the extra wild card reading. Check that one out. See if I pick up the energy there. We've got somebody in here. Let's see your energy. Remember, it's from their perspective. How are, are you seeing my Geminis right now? <clears throat> How are you seeing my Geminis? Pop. Thinking time is needed. Don't make reactive, impulsive decisions. Consider all perspectives. <clears throat> so they definitely got you in the head thinking about something, analyzing something, and not making any kind of rush decisions. See their energy. Their energy. What's your energy? Pop. Not enough. Frustrated in relationship, lack of confidence, self-sabotage, fear, ego issues, and jealousy. What's coming with it? The Grim Reaper. The relationship is over. No second chances. Grow and transform your life. So this person's carrying the underlying energy of, yep, you making a decision. The Grim Reaper is coming down because they're not good enough. And some of the issues may have been, you know, fear-based, ego, jealousy, self-sabotaging. So, let's get on talking, guys. Let's see what deck they would like to use. Talk to us. Gemini. Ooh, guys. They're getting a new one. Let me get it up here. This is for my Gemini's. Their person. The one thing to pay attention on the energy, though, guys, is they do have you thinking about it. There's still possibility. It's not a yes or a no. It's uh, well, maybe, maybe in the future. Just so you'll know. <laughs> Ow, they talking? Feeding the fire of desires. What were they feeding? What were they desiring that they were feeding the fires of? The silence is too much for me. I never meant to make you feel third wheel. There are three sides to this. Yours, mine, and the truth. My fingers don't want to work. Drowning in this pain. Get more than one here. I know it is. Yes, it is. I feel you missing me. Are you missing them, Gemini's? I need to be released from the torture of this. What else? What else? I can't think straight right now. Things changed between us. We need time to find ourselves. It's coming in passively, so it means put it into question form. They're asking you a question. Read between the lines. Question again, guys, is passive. Something about reading between the lines. I know more than you think I do. Ooh. I miss your touch. It feels like I'm nothing more than your current favorite flavor. Mind games, show me that you still care. I want to trigger you, get a reaction. If I can get you to emotionally react to me, I know you care. Because right now they got you sitting in not any kind of reaction. Mm -mm. I know that I don't deserve your forgiveness or your kindness. Anything else? Yeah. I have no peace about this. 
I feel like I have nothing to contribute to this relationship. Getting a lot of green ones. I'm oh, I'm learning that karma has everyone's address. What else? Anything else? Yeah, I see more. I'm gonna get my fingers to work. Self-fulfilling prophecy. I'm learning that karma is everyone's address. Have you moved on? You see every part of me that I tried to keep hidden. I didn't realize how intimately you knew and understood me. Special connection. I want to blame you. Oh, God. More than one here. Selfish and cold of me to want to blame you. I held back because I didn't want to allow my brain to trick me into believing attraction is love. No matter what I do or who I'm with, I feel so alone without you. What if you finally see I'm not good enough for you? I couldn't face you. Do anything else with this? Yeah, there's more. They're going to talk. You wholeheartedly captivated me. That's rare and scary. I'm hearing scary. I still love you. My interest just rapidly declined. I don't know why and I don't understand it myself. Things are not as they appear. I want the ability to show vulnerability. I want your openness. Help me, please. Oh, guys, let's do a last shelter. Yep. Come back to me, please. Two here. It may not be romantic, but it's damn beautiful. I thought it was too good to be true, though. Mm. My fingers do not want to work right. Life is difficult not having you by my side. Ooh, Gemini's hold the energy on the deck. Guys, let's go ahead and get them to focus their energy onto the deck. They want to give you a final and closing message from this week. Smart Gemini's. Talk to us. Mmm. The blue butterflies. But we're getting the shadow side of it. Mm-hmm. I'm a Gemini's person. Put the energy on it. Ooh, right there. Let's go with it. I don't know if I can let you in. Is it really over? Give me a, another chance to show you how much I love you. I didn't follow my heart. I needed, and y'all hear me, I'm wanting to put it in past tense. I need to do what is right for me. That, that was trying to come out in past tense. I needed to do what I thought was right for me. <laughs> like selfish. <laughs> yeah. I feel so jealous over you. I'm scared of losing you. 
I know I was wrong. I'm taking responsibility for my mistakes. Can you forgive me? Will you forgive me? Last one, guys. I screwed up. Oh. Gemini's, that's all I have for us. Sending you love and light. Bless be.